Okay, so why learn PHP? PHP is designed to create uh, dynamic websites. So in order to make a dynamic website, you need to learn uh, a programming or scripting language like PHP. PHP is good because it's uh, created specifically for this purpose. So what is a dynamic website? A dynamic website is one website with uh, any website with login, uh, user profile and web search, for example, all the, those are dynamic websites. So why is it called dynamic? Is because it shows you different information on the same page, depending on who you are, for example. For example, the user profile, the same page will display different information, a different profile image, different name, and so on, depending on who is using that website at that time. So the same page will give you different information depending on different situations. So that is known as a dynamic website. A static website, uh, on the other hand, shows you the same information because it was hard coded, hard typed. Uh, the information can change. Once you request the page, you see the same information over and over. But as long as the information changes on the same page, it's a dynamic website. Okay. The advantage of PHP is also that it's server side technology, meaning that uh, the, the code that you create never goes to the browser. There's a, another language called JavaScript, which actually lives in your browser just like HTML, you know, HTML is sent from the server to your browser and then it's displayed. But PHP is never sent to the browser. So it's called server side uh, language because it lives on the server and never uh, reaches the, uh, the browser. Okay, so the one like JavaScript that reaches the browser is called client side uh, scripting or technology client side as opposed to server side. So this is good because uh, people can see the code that you typed uh, they can steal your code if that's what you are afraid of, like they can do with JavaScript or HTML. So you can also embed HTML, embed PHP into HTML, for example. You know, you mix the two uh, seamlessly without problems. So this is a very good advantage of PHP. PHP has very good support uh, on the internet. If you want any help, just go to php.net and you'll find help for all kinds of things. Even if you just do a Google search of uh, any problem that you have with PHP, you have a lot of answers because a lot of people use it. So you won't run into problems that you won't find solutions to, okay? And most hosting uh, 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 companies support PHP. So you won't have a problem where you are hosting your website and there's no support for PHP because PHP has become very common, especially with the incoming of uh, systems like WordPress because WordPress runs on PHP. So almost every hosting company supports uh, PHP. So what do you need to actually uh, learn PHP? You will need a text editor, just like this notepad we have, but instead we'll need a notepad plus plus, which is more advanced than this normal notepad that we are using right now. Then you will need uh, a web server. The technology we'll be using is called Apache. Apache is the most uh, common technology for web servers. So we're going to need all that. So in order to uh, get Apache, we have to download something called uh, ZAMP. Okay. So there's uh, different technologies here. There's ZAMP, there's WAMP, and there's MAMP. There's also LAMP. So the difference here is that, or well, the thing is, uh, ZAMP comes with Apache. It also comes with MySQL, which is a database. Okay. So those are the things that we need to run. Now, the difference between these is that uh, LAMP is made for a Linux machine, MAMP is for a Mac, and WAMP is for Windows. But ZAMP is sort of like multi-purpose. You can uh, use it on any of these. So I prefer to use ZAMP instead for a general purpose. Okay, so ZAMP will come with uh, Apache, which we need, and MySQL, which is a database that we need to use. And we are going to have to download Notepad++ and install that too. So I'll see you in the next video where we do exactly that.